Hi, this is Gina. Hey, Gina. This is Kevin from AT&T Wireless. Uh, we're yeah. we're going to be changing your phone number today, this 7 2 We're going to have to change that to a brand new phone number over in the 913 area code. So I've, I've got your new number here if you'd like that. We just, we've got to change it. And uh, anyone that calls this old number, this 7 2 number, they're going to get a disconnected message. This has got to be a lie. Why would I lie, ma'am? I'm, why, why, why are you doing that? Well, I'm from the AT&T call center. That's just kind of what we do. But your number is expired. No. And, and somebody else. Uh, this, is, this is not true. Well, no, it's true. Uh, we, we've we got to change your phone number. I've got the brand new phone number here. And what's the area code? Uh, it's going to be in the 913 area code. So basically the same. You know, that's that's Kansas. But it's, uh, you know, right there on the border. It's. I'm not in Kansas. I know, but it's right there on the border. You know, it's very close. I'm not, I'm not even, I'm not even there. Okay, close. ma'am, it, like area codes don't really matter anymore. They're, they're more like an IP address at this point. Like it doesn't matter what area code you have. As long as it's in America, it costs the same to, to call. So you'll, right. be, you'll be fine. So if you got a pin to no. write, write down your new phone number with, I can give that to you. Do you have something to write down your new phone number with? What number is the new number? Oh, okay. Uh, I've got it right here. It is 9,134,836. No, you don't speak that way when you talk about phone numbers. Well, no, it's a 10-digit number, ma'am. So it would start with 9 billion. It would start with a billion. It's not a, it, that, it's, that's not numbers. Okay, ma'am. Just write down the number as I say it. I'll say it slower. Nine billion. No, just say what number. Gina. Just say the number. Gina. You, just say the number. This is how I read phone numbers. This is how most uh, rep- representatives read the phone numbers now. It's a change we made from no. within the company. Do you have? Do you have a manager? Well, do you just not understand large numbers? It's very easy. I can explain it to you. That's not a. It's it, not the way you call numbers. Yes, it is. That's how we this do it has now. Got to be spam, and I'm reporting you. What do you mean spam? How would this be spam? I'm just changing your phone number. I work at the call center. I'm not charging you money for it. It's completely free. It's just your old number is going to be a disconnected number. Is there another way for me to find this out? Uh, yeah, you can call, you know, just call AT&T back and say, hey, what's my new phone number? Hopefully they'll be able to pull up your account, though, because your old number is okay. not going to pull up your account okay. anymore. Okay, I'll do that. So you might have to give your social or your name or something and... It'd be a lot easier if I just gave you your phone number so you could, they could look it up for you when you call them back. Okay, just just give me a digit. Okay, nine Forget billion. Forget the billion part. Forget the billion stuff. Okay. Just say nine. Okay, nine. Uh huh. And then one hundred and thirty-four million. No, just one. One hundred and thirty-four million eight hundred and thirty-six thousand one hundred and eighty-three. It's a faster way to write, ma'am. No, it's not. Yes, it is. If if you wouldn't like, just pr- pretend you can, you know, understand large numbers, and it's easy. No, 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 no. See, phone numbers aren't actual so whole numbers. Like nine one one is not nine hundred and eleven. Oh, some people say it like that. That's just a pre- no. They're wrong. It's not. Well, no, it's just a preference. Well, my preference is to leave the billion part out. Well, ma'am, you're making yourself sound like a Democrat. (laughs) Why do you even think that I'm not or I am? Oh, I can tell. What difference does it make? It it doesn't make a difference at all. I'm just saying that you're kind of coming across as a a Democrat. And I'm, I'm telling you that this is not the way to let people know that they have a new phone number. Well, it's pretty easy. If it's you don't, not you, what AT and T would do. It's, this is wrong. Okay, well, I'm with AT and T, and that's what we do now. Okay, I'm going to call AT and T. Okay, make Thank sure you. you read your phone number as uh, you know it's.
You've been listening to Prank Phone Calls by the Phone Losers of America. Listen to full episodes of the show at snowplowshow.com. Support us at patreon.com slash phone losers. Find more prank call material at worldofprankcalls.com.